एवरीथिंग और नथिंग ब्रोट टू यू बाय स्टीम लाइन लिन एंड सर्विसेज रमेन रहमान वेल इट्स नॉट बैड आई थिंक टू मोर क्वेश्चंस एंड टू मोर गेसिंग आई थिंक यू शुड बी ओके सो लेट्स सी नाउ टेल मी in what year did the bola cyclone hit bangladesh in what year did bola cyclone hit bangladesh causing half a million deaths is it 1959 1966 or 1970 bola cyclone bola cyclone hit bangladesh 1959 1966 or 1970 which year You think or I'm just guessing it's all before I born so 1970 I think I had of it now Yeah I'll go for it 1970 you said and you're right Well done Higher or lower 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 Wrong. How old is Tuck in there? Change your card, please. <clears throat> we'll have to change the card. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, I'm not like on cards. Milaj Khan, do you have any pets? I mean, did not you, ready. Do you have dog or cat or no. goldfish? No. No. Have you ever had any pets? Yep. What pet did you have? No, I haven't. Sorry. You never had no. any pets. No. Very sad. Oh well. Sorry. Let me see if you can guess this answer right because if you had a dog then it would have helped you. How many toes does a dog have? 8 toes, 10 toes or 16 toes? How many toes does a dog have? And say so, say so 8, 10 and 8, 10 or 16. Eight. Wrong. It's sixteen. Oh you should have had a dog. I had a dog in Bangladesh. I had a dog when I was staying there for for one year. I was in Bangladesh for one year, okay. and um, when I was younger, actually, not recently, when I was young, when I was um, seven years old. Okay. Me and my family we were there for one year, and I I had a dog, and um, yeah. Well, the dog is not around, of course. It's long dead, but uh, yeah, I miss. I really miss him. Okay. Um, no, so to say. Are you a cricket fan? Yeah. Yeah, cricket fan. So uh, I guess Bangladesh is your favorite team. Of course. Okay. Then I'm sure you'll. No the answer of this question in okay. what year was the Bangladeshi cricket team granted test status in what year was the Bangladeshi cricket team granted test status was it 1998 1999 or 2000 which year was it 1999 1998 or the year 2000 which year Confused. Uh, I'm confused. Ninety-nine and ninety-eight between these two. I'm a little bit confused. Uh, I'm not sure. Um, I know the test cricket. Two uh, thousand. Uh, Can you hurry up, please? Uh, yes. Um, Ninety-eight, I think. Ninety-eight. You're wrong. Please. The year two thousand. Again, that means no. you're not a huge. Well, um, well, this is a different uh, question. Anyway. Oh well. <clears throat> Remember one. What is Bangladesh's biggest exporting industry? Garment, farming, or fishing? 
what is Bangladesh's Bangladesh's biggest exporting industry? Garment. Correct. Oh no, not again. Haya Olova. Not again. Let's go for low again. Lower. Oh. Ah, <laughs> Sorry. I have to stay out from this part. <coughs> Instead, ask me two questions, please. <laughs> Remember one, your knowledge is helping you, but your luck is not favoring That's you. That's what I'm saying. Not, not today. Well, let's see. Minaj Khan, knowledge, and will also test his luck. What type of acid is used in car batteries? Is it sulfuric acid, hydrochloric acid, or boric acid? Which acid is used in battery batteries of cars? Three options is uh... sulfuric acid, hydrochloric acid, or boric acid? Sulfuric acid. Correct. Higher or lower? I will go higher again. Higher. Well done. Minister Hussain, according to the Bangladeshi census of 2011, what percentage of Bangladeshi population read newspapers? What percentage of Bangladeshi population read newspapers? Is it 15%? Is it 20%? Or is it 25%? In 2011. Yeah. According to Bangladeshi census of 2011. Just guessing, this is a very, very hard question. I think 25%. 25%? Yes. You're wrong. It's 15%. Ruben Rahman, have you been in Bangladesh during the time of Kurbani? Yes. Have you been um, involved in um, slaughtering um, cow. Yeah. Now tell me, how many stomachs does a cow have? How many stomach does a cow have? Two, three or four? How many? How many stomach does a cow have? Two, three or four? Two. You're wrong. It's four. I didn't know. <laughs> Minashka. What is the most common metal in the Earth's crust? Aluminium, iron, or magnesium? What is the common metal in the earth crust? Aluminium, iron or magnesium? Aluminium. Great. Higher or lower? Hundred percent lower. Yes, yes you're right. <laughs> no, so the same. What does the A in CIA stand for? America, agency or association? What does A in CIA stand for? CIA is American uh, uh, intelligent, intelligent. Um, so, uh, what is it called? Like FBI, CIA. Yes. So, what does A stand for in CIA? A, uh, A does. Is it Asso America? Is it agency or is it association? Agency. Correct. Higher or lower? <coughs> higher, please. Higher? Yes, I think higher. It's 
Lower. Lower. I think if I this way, so maybe higher. Ruben. <laughs> Two more cards. What is the only river that starts and ends in Bangladesh? Is, this, is, is it Podda, Shongu, or Jomuna? Which river starts and ends in Bangladesh? Podda, Shongu, or Jomuna? Shongu. Correct. Oh, not again. Higher no. or lower? Higher. Oh. Correct. At last got it. <laughs> Minaj, in which country would you find the Blue Mosque? Afghanistan, Turkey, or Jordan? Turkey. Correct. Last card, Minaj. Higher or lower? Lower. Are you sure? Last card. You get this right, you're going to the next level. Lower. Lower. Well done. Well, ladies and gentlemen, now we have the winners who have qualified to enter the next round, Tufail and Minhaj. They both will be competing against each other on our next round. So thank you very much everybody for coming and participating. So um, get out there, read a lot and get very more knowledge of the world of Bangladesh as well. So good luck and thank you. Thank, thank you very much. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the second round of Everything or Nothing. In this round, contestant will be throwing their darts on the dartboard. Whoever scores the highest will go to the final round. Now I would like to call Tufail Uddin on stage and throw the darts and try to achieve the highest score. Tufail Uddin, please come. Stand right here. And Eight, nine, and six. Eight, nine, and six. Thank you very much, Tufeluddin. Tufeluddin has scored eight, nine, and six, which totals up to 23. Now, I would like to invite Minaj Khan on stage and try to beat Tufeluddin's score. Minaj Khan, please come. Is the darts and the dartboard. Six. Six. One. Six, six and one equals 13. You've completed the first round and unfortunately, um, because you're gonna score higher than Tufeluddin, you have lost the second round. So that means you can't go through the final round. So um, please, Tell me and the, the audience who are watching at home, um, you, your, your feeling, uh, how you're feeling right now. And you, ha you had a lot of opportunities, but unfortunately you couldn't get the numbers, uh, guess the numbers right, you couldn't get the answers right. So tell us how you're feeling right now. Everything or nothing. এখানে আসতে হবে এবং ভাগ্যের একটি যে খেলা এবং কিছু নলেজ থাকতে হবে সব কিছু মিলে চমৎকার একটি নাম চমৎকার একটি উদ্যোগ চ্যানেল এসের আমি ধন্যবাদ জানাবো চ্যানেল এসের ম্যানেজমেন্টকে এবং এই প্রোগ্রামটি দ্বারা যারা তৈরি করেছেন কলাকুশলী যারা ছিলেন এবং মেনাস কেব্রিয়াকে এই অনুষ্ঠানে আজকে প্রথম এপিসোড প্রথমে আমি বলবো আমি খুব ভাগ্যবান একজন মানুষ বিকজ আজকের এই প্রথম শোর প্রথম একজন মানে কন্টেস্টেন্ট হতে পেরে সে আমি নিজেকে গর্ববোধ করছি এবং সেকেন্ড রাউন্ডে আসার জন্য আমি মনে করি যে এটা আমার জন্য একটা সুযোগ ছিল 
কারণ এখানে একটা ফিজিক্যাল ফিটনেসের ব্যাপার আছে কিন্তু জিনিসটা আসলে উল্টা হয়ে গেল সরি টু সে আসলে তোফায়ল ভাই বেশ হেলথ একজন সুন্দর একজন স্বাস্থ্যবান মানুষ কিন্তু ওইখানে হয়তো আমি হেরে গেলাম কিন্তু তারপরে মজা লাগছে আমাদের মিডিয়ারই একজন মানুষ আছেন আমাদের সাথে চমৎকার একজন মানুষ আছেন আর আমি আবারও ধন্যবাদ জানাচ্ছি চ্যানেল এসকে থ্যাংক ইউ বিনাশ থ্যাংক ইউ ভেরি মাচ বেস্ট অফ লাক লেডিস এন্ড জেন্টলম্যান উই হ্যাভ কমপ্লিটেড আর ফার্স্ট রাউন্ড অ্যান্ড দেন উই কমপ্লিটেড আর সেকেন্ড রাউন্ড and tonight's contestant we had Rumain Rahman we had Nusrat Hussain and Minaj Khan who went to the second round and Tufaluddin who has completed the first round and the second round and now has gone through to the final round now we will be bringing you the final round of everything or nothing Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the final round of Everything or Nothing. In this round, Mr. Tufail Uddin will have to guess the numbers of the cards, higher or lower than the previous card. Every single card, if he gets right, if he gets the card right, he wins a prize. So every single card will have a prize each. There's four, there, there's four cards in the guessing wall. One card will be revealed. and he has to guess every other cards onwards so every card he wins he gets a prize mr tufaeldin are you ready sir as ready as i'll ever be in this round you don't have to answer any questions you don't have to throw anything you just have to guess the numbers okay the first card i will reveal for you Ladies and gentlemen, Tufailud Din's first card is number 13. If he gets the first card right, if he guesses the card right, he will win a coffee maker. Tufail, higher or lower? Uh, I hope 13 is lucky for me. I would guess uh, lower. Lower. Right, you won coffee maker. I like Con- coffee. Congratulations. Thank you. Next card. Higher or lower? On this card the prize will be meal for four at a nice restaurant. Meal for four, higher or lower? Uh, it's going to have to be higher. Higher? Sure? Sure. Higher. Higher. Yes. Coffee maker meal for four. Next card and this is the final card and final prize. 100 pound voucher to spend in a men's clothing shop. Higher or lower? I'll guess higher. Higher. It's final card. Final card of the show. You said higher. I've said it now. I higher. High or low? Let's find out. Haya, yes. To find the thing, you have won a coffee maker, you have won meal for four and you have won 100 pound voucher to spend in a men's clothing store. Well done. Thank you. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, this brings us to the end of the show, end of everything or nothing. It seems like Mr. Tufail has won everything in our show, so he's living with everything. Mr. Tufail, thank you so much. Mr. Tufail Uddin will join us at the grand finale. of everything or nothing thank you very much for watching the show and eid mubarak to everyone have a fantastic eid with your friends and family thank you everything or nothing brought to you by steamline linen services